Greetings all, Frog here. Let's play a three minute world challenge. Hopefully that was enough time for the seed on the screen. If not, it's always in the links. Australia. Um, no, that's going to be too far for the camera to read reliably. Uh, let's see, can I get onto that road? No, and that's, yeah, that's just too far away. It's alright, it's fair. Really a shame I can't drive down that road, though. Hmm. That's okay. It's like a mesa back over there. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't be stopped. Mm -hmm. I suppose we could be in South Africa. That's definitely a possibility. I suppose with the maces, that might be more realistic. But I don't know. Oh, way too far. Okay, we're going to have to try and zoom What? Have to try and zoom in best we can. Kumba Iron Ore. Okay. Is iron more prevalent in Australia or South Africa? Well, if I'm going to be stereotypical, or base the region based on the people walking in the region, then I'd say we're in South Africa. Because they look more like South Africans than they do Aboriginals. And they sure don't look like ex-British... Well, we're not going to. I mean, we don't need to mention the uh, penal colony. Uh, Sishin Katu. I have a minute left to figure out what the heck all this means. This is this is perfect. Pretty typical for me, though, let's be honest. Gamagara Municipality, Split Station Line, and New Van Royen. That looks very Dutch. So, oh. I see this with 37 seconds. With 37 seconds left, this is what I see. Oh, you've got to be—you got to be kidding me. Um, um. Uh, I mean, we're like in here, right? We're just—we're just like in here. It's not gonna be that bad. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, that's close, right? That's that's close. <sighs> All right. Well, next round. Calle of Cortes. If I knew the little flag symbol, that would help a lot. But that's street in, in Spanish. Or maybe avenue or, or alley or, or whatever. But you see it all over the place in Mexico. So that is sort of helpful in that we're in a Spanish-speaking country, whether it's Mexico or Spain itself. You know, who knows? Or some other... South American country. Um, the CM4000. That sounds like a really bad vacuum cleaner or something. It's the CM4000. No, I certainly don't want to guess Greenland. Let's not make that middle of the ocean my guess. Yeah, that's that's smooth. All right. Um, whoa, what's going on with the map here? Let me, let, me, let me shrink you down. Shrink you down again. Something's going on with the map. Okay. Now let's, let's go back out. Nope, something's going on with the map. Oh, blast. This is going to be challenging. All right, CM, CM. What's going on with this map? Seriously, map? What What the hell? Oh, that's bad. It's like the map got drawn in the wrong spot. If I refresh this, it's going to start this challenge all over again, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Well, we just might have to try and use it at this, at this maybe this resolution. Okay, well, that wasted way too much time. CM4000. Wow. Um, you know, let's say this is Spain. Let's take it, let's take a chance. CM, what could that stand for? N A A E E X C M. 
If that were a province in Spain, what province would that be? CM. I'm not certain. I kind of just want to get the right province, and then I'm just going to plunk it down in there because I have 54 seconds left and just deal with it. I might have to get one level in more to get to the C. Those small things. Those smaller roads. AP. That sort of makes sense because that's Aragon. Um, CM, huh? I want one more. Got nothing. CM. All right, so we're in this region. Bam. Nice. Probably it's like Central Madrid. Central de Madrid or something. No idea. Should figure that out, you know, at some point, I guess, because it would certainly be helpful. Um, I don't know. Next round. I know somebody will help me out. Probably Nayo. Nayo's probably infinitely better at this than I am. You should have your own channel. Um, or come guest on my channel. We'll hook up the Skype call. We'll get it done. We'll play a little tag team GeoGuessr. Really? Okay, what is that language? Arabic, isn't it? Are we in the Arabic-speaking world for the first time? This might be our first time. Wow, this would be tremendously helpful if I knew what that was. I mean, like, tremendously helpful. The only thing is, I don't know, how would we play this together? How could you possibly do that? Well, you could play the same, same challenge seed, and you could just race each other, all right? But then, how do you determine... I don't even know what... Wow. I don't even know what countries... Arabic spoken in a lot of the world, man. I mean, a lot of the world. There's different types, too. Like, is this Farsi? Because to me, this kind of looks like um, um, uh, Indonesia. Like, that would be the kind of English transliterations that I would expect to see if I were in Indonesia. We're driving on the left? What is this madness? Maybe, maybe it's a one-way street. Um, oh, 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 oh. Oh, are we in Malaysia? No, I don't think so. Isn't that the Malaysian flag, though? I feel like that's the Malaysian flag. Look at all of this going on right here. Kuala Lumpur in the E2. That's definitely in, in here. Oh, wow, I didn't think there was a large... Um, Islamic speaking area, but there must be. That's definitely the flag of Malaysia. We've had this one before. I've run out of time in Malaysia before. Because that's the flag. Well, I mean, obviously there's there's a large Islamic influence because this is I don't know if it is now. I don't I don't know the history of it, but I don't know the current, but the history is that this is a very Islamic state, Sunni state. Um, um well here. We're we're here ish. It's, I mean it's close enough. Okay, we're farther. We're much farther south of Malacca, but hey, that's okay. That's pretty good. All right, round four. Round three? Round four. Blazing through this. Blazing speed. This is not good. Driving on the right. Apparently in Europe. Um, hmm. Mountains of southern France. I know, it's a bad habit. I just zoomed right past that tanker. That could have had some useful information on it. Uh, I, it's this time limit, I think, that, that makes me lazy. Von Hool. Oh, no! What are you doing to me? Where's my cheat sheet? Oh, no. Oh, phew, I found it. I was worried the wife was cleaning up and I lost it forever. This is my lifeblood. P. 
pro prod prodash pro pro prodash b prodash b serb what's the b v serv servie 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 it's some all right well kiss my grits and look at this too we're like oh yeah excellent there's gonna be a website dot com really that's just mean and the problem is hold on if i go back again i know this is this is ridiculous there's no good shot of this truck but look look at what could be right here this could be like where they're from which would be so helpful but if i go one forward or on the other side we're going too fast Uh, I was hoping to see like a dot ru or something to at least get that out of it, because well, like it matters. I mean, if we're in Russia, we're we're toast. You really only can do Russia if you don't have a time limit. So is this now? We have to decide what mountain range in Russia is this? Is this the Urals? Is this you know somewhere in Siberia? Is this what is this? I don't know, but I have 44 seconds left to figure it out. Uh, no. Nope, 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 nope. Oh. Hope your french fries are ready, because the salt is coming. Nah, it's tough to get salty. I mean, it's it's Russia, right? This just, oh, come on. Oh, come on. Help me out. Help a brother out. At least those famous bilingual signs that are never going to help me because I don't speak either of the languages on the sign. Oh my goodness gracious me. Um, we're here. We were in Bulgaria. The cars go to Bulgaria? The cars go to Bulgaria, guys. Yet yeah, another Cyrillic country I'm not going to have to worry about. Oh. Got me good, cuz. You got me good. Single white lines on the outside. Mountainous region uh, looks very similar to mm, to like a European country again. I like those little light, uh, the mirrors rather that kind of show you if a car is coming or not. It's very cool. Oh, hey, not in Europe. Um. Japan, maybe? Um, maybe. China, maybe? I don't, I don't know. I admit to not being able to tell the difference between those two languages written very well. But I doubt that I'm alone in that. Uh, that looks way too cute to be Chinese. So, if we're in Japan... The mountain is no longer helpful. <laughs> I mean, it's just not. Fire hydrant. Alan, do you have that one in your vocab? If not, throw it in there. Yeah, we're definitely driving on the left, so we're in Japan. I mean, there's there's no question about that now. Um, but I'm not sure how I'm going to figure out which island we're on, let alone where in Japan. Trixie... Trixie Rabbits. It's not a lot of English, though, so this, to me, makes it feel like you know, less of a tourist area. Oh, that, no. Darn, I saw the blue. I was hoping it was a road sign. No, just a tarpaulin. Which does me zero bits of good. Um. Okay, so... What can I figure out here in the next 40 seconds or so? Well... You got me stumped. Oh, hello. We're at the junction. We're on the 49. Okay, we're on the 49. Japan, go. We're on the 49. Can I find the 49? I feel like we've been on the 49 before. But it has been quite some time since we've been in Japan. 
And this map graying issue is not helping in the least. There's the 49. Okay, so we're on the 49. I have 15 seconds left. So, you know what? We're on the 49. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it in a heartbeat. Because that was that was really tough. Oh, smokes! 19,000 points. That's better than I thought we were doing. That's cool. If it weren't for that whole Russian-Bulgaria thing, we'd be good. I mean, if they just hit a poster of Victor Crumb flying in the background, then I'd know exactly where we were. But no, they've got to just, you know, suppress the Quidditch. Whatever. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, click the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel to stay updated to everything as it happens. And until next time, cheers.